Good morning from Vientiane. There's a trouble there. I'm moving from Vientiane to Van Van Vien. Van Vien. It's two hours away by minibus. And it costs how much does it cost? Six pounds fifty. Six pounds fifty on a minibus. As I mentioned uh, in the last vlog, you can't get the train, but it's, it's a long way out of town and it's much more expensive. So being a budget traveller, minibus it is. Two hours. Travelling with my friend Song Jay from South Korea. And this is my accommodation in Vientiane. What I'll do is we'll take you through the full travel trip today. We'll see what the minibuses are like in Lao. I know many of you have seen many of my travels in Thailand and the minibus drivers are crazy. They're just chasing the money all the time. So we'll see what today's like in Lao. So this is where I've been staying in the Nana Backpackers Hostel. Very busy. It's a bit of a party hostel, but you don't get no noise. It's been a great stay, it really has. Have a bar, all fruit, you can get breakfast. Food's very, very good priced. You can get uh, chicken and rice for two pounds. Nice pool area. Do you have a lift? Free pool table. Plenty of toilets kicking about, showers. Now up on the first floor. You down here from there? Oh, I do. Yeah, yeah. Upstairs? Yeah. Okay, see. Toilets and showers are really clean, and the, the shower is really hot. Very, very good. And inside, it's inside. It's just a regular, regular dorm room. You got your bed, curtain. Remember to take the towel down. You leave a deposit for the towel. So yeah, it's been really good. Please subscribe, like, and share with your friends. It's a beautiful day here in Vintia. It's uh, 31 degrees. And yeah, it's really, really nice. Really nice. I've really adopted to Lau. I'm only going to be here, but like I said in the last vlog, just over a week. But it's been great. Hello, my friend. Hello. And this place is £6.50 a night. £6.50. You get the pool, you get everything included. Uh, your bed, shower, everything like that. Uh, you got pool tables, sabutio. Everything's free, apart from the food. But yeah, it's been great. It's been really, really good. So yeah, let's get on the road to Bang Vien. We're getting the sardine experience. Never been so packed. Never been so packed. <laughs> Am I gonna be on TV? You're gonna be on TV. YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's your name? Uh, Steve. Steve. Uh, I'm Richie. Uh, nice to meet you, Steve. This is the worst no, experience ever. I should have got the train. Really? I definitely should have got the train. At least I got money back. Next time. We've been sat on this bus for nearly an hour, and we're not going anywhere. I don't know what's going on. We've just been sat in some sort of garage or something. I don't know what, what, what I don't even have no idea what the driver's doing. People want to get off and just walk and just stay, stay here. Okay, let's go. I feel like I'm. Oh. 
Steve's having to get off. He feels like he's having a heart attack. I think he's going to see you. It is bad. It is crazy bad. What's going to happen? Burnt out fields. There's a lot of oil. It's like a whole forest, a whole mountain. Then back to the lovely greenery. Beautiful mountains here as well. Did you book your accommodation today? Yeah. Where? Mm. Yeah. Uh, top. There's Song Jay walking in the distance. A lovely young lad, a lovely lad from South Korea. We've had a great couple of days together. Uh, Van Gen looks amazingly beautiful. Yeah. All the mountains in the background. Song Jay's hotel is two minutes down there. I've got an eight minute walk just up the road. I'm so looking forward to this visit. It looks really, really nice here. I would like to get to Lang Caban, but I'm not too sure how, how long of a trip it's going to be. Obviously, because I want to get back up to Vientiane to cross up back over the Friendship Bridge, because I want to visit more of Nong Kai, like I've said earlier and then travel down slowly back down south with Kanchanaburi for Songkran Shoe repair I think my Adidas trainers need a bit more need a bit more repairing so that's good to know Just walk past the walking street, so I'll be checking that out later on. And we'll go, go and get some food. I got my bag, I got my bag dropped off at the hostel, and we'll go and get some food. Check out Van Vieng. Welcome to the walking street night market. Wow, look at the mountains. Kayaking, water caves, karaoke. <laughs> Looks like there's plenty to do here. I hope Steve was okay, the guy from Sri Lanka who had to get off the bus. It wasn't a good journey, it wasn't a good journey. We were rammed into that bus. There were 16 people on such a small in, in such a small minibus. And he felt like he couldn't breathe. And I seen where he was coming from. It was, it was not nice. It was not nice. Uh, the driver was okay. He wasn't flying. Not like doing some place in Thailand. So the journey was all right. But it took us about an hour and a half to get out of the NTN, which was crazy. He just kept stopping everywhere. I was like, what are you doing? People were banging on the windows. and saying, come on, we want to go. We want to leave. And he was just ignoring them. He was like, what are you doing, mate? Like, just take us to our destination. And then you just get, yeah, he just kept stopping, saying you can get out if you want, go to the toilet. Uh, I think well, at one point he took like a, a meal break. I think I'm, I'm assuming a week before he picked us up, mate. But yeah, 
it, we, we got here it took just over two and a half hours when they said two hours so considering uh, well or three and a half hours considering we never left behind Tain for an hour and a half but the, the journey itself when we actually got set off it was it was it was okay it was good and uh, Lau Lau looks beautiful looks like such a beautiful place it would be a lovely country and you can see now the mountains so so pretty a lot of different destinations so one one hundred thousand kip is three pound eighty one hundred thousand so to go to Lang Prabang you're talking 17 pounds on a private on a private van see I don't want to be putting too many miles in I want allowed to be more of an, um, a relaxing experience but it's, it's all a reconnaissance this while I'm here I'm just doing reconnaissance on Lao, seeing what it's like, seeing if I enjoy it. If I do, I'll come back in, I'll tour the full country. Wow, look at this place. This is what I'm all about, the mountains. I've just checked into the accommodation. I'll show you that another day, obviously because I've showed you the one where I was staying in Vientiane this morning. So I'll pop that in a whole, whole different vlog. I'm booked in here for three nights. It looks really nice, really nice, extremely cheap. And you won't believe how cheap this place is. So keep watching. And my next vlog, one of my next vlog, or the, the one after, I'll show you how much it costs, what it's like. So you're talking for the fruit drinks, 25,000. Where are we at? It's not far away from a pound. 95p, 25,000. The dragon fruit, banana and chocolate. One pound 15. I've just had a uh, chicken and vegetable sandwich it was in a big big ass for a pancake starting off at 30 uh, 20 thousand it's just less than 80p working up to 35 thousand as always the price comparison will be in the description so you can work out for yourself i don't want to keep shouting out prices all the time you get the general idea it's very 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 cheap and the sandwich was good although it was drowned in mayonnaise which made it extremely messy it was still very nice so yeah it's very cheap very cheap in Bambiang burgers 40,000 I will definitely be treating myself to a pancake later on. What a beautiful sunset. I don't know if you can see right up there, the two parasailers. They look dangerously close together. Had a freak gust of wind and they're getting wrapped up and they're going down. Heads up, I will definitely not be doing that. <laughs> what I will be doing is heading out to a restaurant and getting some food. Just been researching where to go for some food to a restaurant. 
not a very happy Richie right now. I've just been uploading the VNTN vlog. I know it's going to be laid out. Um, I, I lost a lot of the footage. The, 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 the sound went down for some reason, but no idea why. That's the most annoying thing is I've got no idea why the sound went off. So I don't know if it's going to be a continuation. It could be my SD card. No idea, but that was so annoying because I lost about 20 minutes of footage from VNTN. But all is not lost. I will be back there within a few days before I go back to Nonkai. So yeah, it's very annoying. And now the vlog is late coming out because with YouTube, I had to cut the footage. Obviously because there's no point in walking about when you can't hear what I'm saying. So we'll see, we'll see. We'll see if it's a continuation or... The Wi-Fi here in Van Vang isn't the best. So whether it was something to do with that or not, I don't know. But hopefully this will not be a continuation. If you watch the channel a lot, you know I'm absolutely hopeless with technology. So yes, that's why I don't know what is going on. It's now 6.30 and it is 28 degrees. Crispy pork, pork chicken. Uh, crispy pork, pork chicken? Crispy pork and chicken. <laughs> Gary's Irish bar. There's a football in there. Sab ID. Beautiful evening. I'm at the Chai Si restaurant and I've gone for egg noodles with barbecue pork. Now I heard that the service here was really bad, so I knew what to expect. Yeah, they're so slow, so slow. Nobody come over um, to, uh, I had to go and find somebody to order some food. And uh, yeah, it is what it is. Hopefully, the egg noodles with crispy pork or barbecue pork will be good. The reviews also it's good as well. Here it is, fifty thousand kip, so it's about just over two pound. Really good. Really nice. Can't complain. Nice pork, vegetables, noodles, instant noodles, man. But you can't have it all. Thanks for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the trip from Vientiane to Van Vien. And uh, I hope you can join me in the next one. Again, please like, subscribe. It helps the channel out enormously. And I'll catch you in the next one. Have a good day, guys.